Thanksgiving is a real treat yourself kind of holiday and today's dish takes that indulgence to the next level. When I asked Iron Chef Jose Garces to share one of his favorites, he invited us into his new East Falls culinary space to make his decadent short rib mac and cheese. This dish does take time and patience, but it is worth every second and every calorie, we promise. When you ask people what the highlight of their Thanksgiving meal is, I feel like 99% of people say it's the mac and cheese. It's always the macaroni. <laughs> I do Latin side dishes, but always do mac and cheese as well. So yeah, so this is kind of, it's a riff on it. Now his delicious riff does require time. That special holiday dish level of devotion. Have a glass of wine, yes. some music on. Let the process just kind of like, Start with the meat. The recipe calls for short rib, but here Chef Garces is using a chuck roast. Coat it with olive oil, salt, and pepper, and get a nice sear in a hot pan. I'm gonna flip this guy here. We're just looking to get a little caramelization. Oh, nice. Now remove the meat and add onions and garlic. You have to let them like sweat and kind of get like release all their flavor. While that's going, we're gonna get our cheese sauce. Okay. Off. Sounds good. Yes, this is the. Um, this is where it really gets happy. Mix milk and heavy cream and heat it over a low flame with some herbs and aromatics to give it flavor. Once it starts simmering, it's pretty much done and we'll strain it. Add that to a flour and butter roux and whisk in your cheese quartet. We have American cheddar, Gruyere, Cooper Sharp. This is definitely high-end cheese sauce. High-end, yes. high, you know, definitely. L like this is luxury cheese sauce. Luxury. Meanwhile, the onions and garlic are ready, so we pop the meat back in with tomato paste, spices, chilies, and stock. Let it simmer for a bit, and then pop it in the oven for three hours at 300. Something comforting about braised beef. But I think also you, when you eat it, you know that time went into it. So there's something that's good for the soul about that. Absolutely. Once it's done, shred it. I'm barely working here. You want to have it be pretty much falling apart. Time to assemble. Mix the cheesy goodness into your pasta, then that short rib, and add a nice breadcrumb topping. Yeah. Bake for about 20 minutes, and we dare you to wait any longer. Mm. Next level. It's, I don't know. It's the most <laughs> wonderful time of the year. It is. <laughs> it really is. Ooh, this is good. It's so good. And if you want to just eat it and not make it, Jose will make it for you. It's one of the dishes he offers on Cook Unity. It's a meal delivery service where top chefs across the country do the cooking and you just do the heating and serving. So that's exactly what we did this morning. We put a little yeah. order in. Yeah. I didn't make this one. Look at that. It looks Jose delicious. Jose Garces made this so for nice. you. So nice. Alicia and had to do this because we were both going like this at it. Yeah, I was looks like, I really still have good. things I have to tell the people about this. Thank you. All right, well, I'm this. not going to talk after this, but it looks so good. Thanks, Alicia. Okay. Thank you, Jose. Looks wonderful. All right, well, I'm going to oh. eat mine. I love it. <laughs> that's I wasn't delicious. ready for the tight shot. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, that's awkward. <laughs> they, they, they just wanted to see how much you're really It's really good. It's delicious. delicious. Is it good? Yeah. Do you love it? I mean, it? I had to put a bib on and then I took it off. Okay. Yeah. But this is treat yourself, is this it This is not? my plate, right? I'm going to smash this in the commercial break. All right, great. <laughs> Thanks, guys.